must save her. My daughter. How's it going guys? Lucian Sword here, playing some more Breath of the Wild for you guys today as always. Hope you're having a fantastic day, wherever you guys might be. Oh man. So since we are here in Hateno Village, I thought it might be a good idea to dye the armor that we got in the Rito Village. I'm talking about the Snow Quill set. This is a really beautiful set, even as it is, but I kind of want to see what color options are available. So let's talk to our good friend, Sage. <laughs> Only 20 rupees is a bargain, dude. Let's see what we can do. Oh man, blue looks really good. We got red. Yellow is so vibrant. Wow. White looks really good too, just because it's snow. I might do the white because then it's like more camouflage to the snow. I mean, this is a snow set. Black, orange, navy. Light blue isn't bad either, actually. Pink. <laughs> Pink is really bright. Um... Yeah, I think I'm going to do white, guys. I actually really like that. Assuming I have the five ingredients. Oh, man. Five silent princess. Or dime. Oh, no. We'll use white chew jelly. I only have two of those, but... We'll use those and the star fragment. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> silent princesses and uh, white chew jelly should do it. I'm surprised I only had two white chews, man. That's crazy. Hold your breath. Actually, I'm going to take a sip of tea while we watch Link suffer. <gasps> the white isn't that big of a difference because it was already kind of like a light tan. But, ooh, that looks so clean. <laughs> How is it? It's fantastic. Thank you, Sage. Oh, man. Now this looks so good. Alright, um, let's see. We need to go and get this final tower, boys. That's what we really need to do. It's so far away, but... Alright, let's go to the Geno Shrine. And I know it looks close to the Geno Shrine, but it's like a massive cliff to get up there. We're just gonna have to climb it. Ah, oh, you know what? I should have maybe cooked a little bit more uh, stamina ingredients before we did this. Because I don't, I don't even know if I have enough stamina to climb this kind of cliff. Well, we shall see. Also, I probably don't need this armor equipped because we're in the desert. <laughs> Alrighty, so yeah, see what I mean? Oh, there is actually like a walkway up. Alright, so maybe it won't be as difficult as I thought. Let's get in the uh, gear. I like wearing the ancient leggings, I don't know why. I just think they look cool. So... I already cleared out that camp. If we climb up to there, I could probably get up there pretty easily. So let's do that. Time to climb, Link. Man, imagine how strong Link's arms and legs must be to climb up this kind of stuff. He's just climbing all the time. There we go. Oh yeah, I forgot. I have so much stamina now. This makes it so much easier to climb high distance. Oh my goodness. I forgot. We got two extra stamina, ves stamina vessels uh, when we went to Hateno Village. That makes us so much easier. Oh, Korok puzzle. Let's grab the uh, rush room so we can upgrade our climber's gear. Ooh, where's the piece? Oh, it's up there. Um, Right in there. Thank you. 
We haven't got a Korok seed in ages, so that was nice. Alright, uh, yeah, let's climb up the rest of the way so we can get to that little, uh, catwalk up here. Alright. Man, who constructed this? This is crazy. I wonder if there's a Lionel down there. I would not mind uh, trying to kill a Lionel. I don't. Th I have not fought a Lionel once in this playthrough yet, but I feel like the time is near because I don't know. I just feel like we're strong enough to do it now. Before I was a little iffy, but I feel like we could do it now. You know what I mean? What do you guys think? Next time I find a Lino, we're gonna fight it. I'm a little bit scared, but at the same time, you gotta have faith in your abilities. Ooh, I almost fell off. Was it this way? Oh. <laughs> what do we have here? He's doing a really good job. Oh. You found me! Well, at least he died instantly, you know, he didn't suffer or anything. Alright, we made it up here. Ooh, ooh, I almost fell off there. I see a red Poe, that's like a fire wand, let's go get that. The tower is right up there, so we're gonna kill the Poe. And then we will go up to that catwalk. Oh, right in the face. Let's just kill him the easy way. A fire rod would be handy. Uh, let's just chuck the club. I'd rather have the fire rod. And, ooh, that's a tall climb, but we should be able to do it. There's also a rush room right there. Definitely need to get the rush room so that we can upgrade the armor. I, I just remember that it takes a lot of rush rooms, and if you don't go for them, you'll just never upgrade the climber's gear, so... Mm. This tea is really delicious. Uh-oh, am I going to have enough stamina to, to do anything here? Instead of going for the catwalk, I'm just going to go straight to the top. I might be able to rest on these uh, sticks right here. It's a little bit risky, but we could try it. Oh, <laughs> oh, I did it. Alright. Very nice. This is not as hard as I thought it would be. Should we look at that view? Look at that view, guys. One of the most impressive things about this game is just how far the view distance is. Every time I see a wolf, it reminds me. I gotta summon my own wolf. Oh, they didn't like that. They didn't like that one bit. This is your leader. Bow down or die. Those are your options. Bend the knee, wolf. Okay. You have chosen death. Yeah, he, yeah. you better run. You better run. Should have ran in the beginning. Alright. Can I summon Cookie? Oh my gosh. Cookie is just so lazy. He never wants to come help me out. The tower is right up there. Ooh, there's a platform there too. Interesting, but we're like right below it. Actually, guys, I wonder if we could like shoot a burning arrow up there and it would cause the... Ooh, another fire po. Wow. Maybe we can uh, make that plat make the chest on the platform come down to us. Yeah, they just run now. They don't even want to mess with Wolf Link anymore. You coming this way, Poe? Whoa, there's a target way up there. Must be a Korok seed. Alright, let's see if I can do this. Oh, 
Oh, come on. Does it burn the... It doesn't burn the platform. Alright. Let's just pop the balloons then. That worked perfectly. All right, there's one chest. That one might be a bit hard to get. And there's the golden chest. And that, no, 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 no. Oh, whew, it almost fell. That's basically the some way to get the, <laughs> let's see what we got. Ruby, ooh, I think those are expensive, very nice. Oh nice, five bomb arrows that dude had. Come on. Ah, oh, Gerudo Spear, durability up, that actually looks awesome. All right, let's drop something, I don't even care. Uh, Let's just chuck the Royal Broadsword. I know it's cool and everything, but I don't care, I want the Gerudo Spear. Butterfly, butterfly. Okay, fine. Be that way. Now let's go get that Korok seed. It's on the way to the tower. In fact, I need to climb up this cliff. So let's do that. I would love a meteor rod instead of just a fire rod. Just another fire rod, no big deal. So what's what's the deal with this? Easy. And then let's go up. Up, up, up. Come on, Wolf Link, climb on up. <laughs> He's like, Master, you have left me. Ah, uh, he'll be fine. Dang, that's a nice looking view as well. That looks awesome. Almost there, guys, almost to the top. Come on, Link. You can do it. Ooh, it's actually getting cold. Alright, perfect. I can actually use my snow quill set. So at least equip the pants. That'll help me a little bit here. Ugh. Made it. Woo. There's Wolf Link. All right, we finally made it to the tower. What's that? Another Korok puzzle, guys. Go across this land bridge. And so what's going on with this tower? This is the last tower we have to get in the entire game. Oh, that is just kind of a bittersweet thing for me. Wow, these are giant bricks. Or not bricks, you know what I mean. Oh, so this is like a tar pit. I gotcha. Oof. Oof. Big tar pit. All right, well. There might be a chest or something in this tar pit too. Ow! That kind of backfired on me. Sorry, Wolfly. You gotta watch out for that. Alright, let's get the Korok seed up here. Since it's just chilling right here. Oh, what kind of puzzle is this, man? What? Over here? No, no, over here. How about right here? Yup. Oh, he's got little branches of holly.
All right. Now, I think we're ready to get this tower. Why is it so windy? Is there a dragon? Dragon? No, just super windy. Gosh, every time I, I see a lot of wind coming, I just always assume there's a dragon. Oh, it's dominoes, guys. They're dominoes. Oh my gosh. Oh, that's what the wind is for. It's so you can't fly to the tower. They really want you to do it this way. That's totally fine by me. A red rupee. Some of you may be thinking, why are you breaking all those? You might need them. Nah, we're going to be good. These massive ones are all we need. Observe. <laughs> Sorry, Wolfie. No! No! Woo. All right, now to push over the dominoes, a bomb arrow. Easy. The Wasteland Tower. Our final tower, guys. Final tower hype. Oh my goodness. I can't believe it. It took so long to get here. Look at this beautiful sunset. We're going to get the final tower right during the sunset. Here we go. The final tower. And it's a huge region as well. Complete map of Hyrule extracted. We did it, boys. We finally did it. The entire map is now uncovered. But that's just the beginning, because now we actually have to do, find everything in the map. We have to find all the shrines. There's 120 shrines that I want to find. There's another maze right there. There's a puzzle right here. There's a lot to do in the Gerudo Desert. And in fact, that's where we're headed next. So, let's do it. Let's head that way, guys. In fact, I'm going to fly this way because it seems like that is the path towards the Gerudo Desert. Oh boy. Yep. 
No! My weapon? He made me drop it. What a bully. Wolf Link, where are you? Where'd he go? I see a shrine down there. All right, let's get the ore first. Ore is important. I love luminous stones. Luminous stones bring me lots of money. No, 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 no. Alright, we got the luminous stones. Oh my gosh. So many of these electric chews. Alright, let's go finish this guy off. Do not hit my dog! There's more luminous stones over there. Come on, Cookie. Oh my goodness. Alright, we'll leave the luminous stones in favor of the shrine. Wait, where'd that shrine go? Alright. Just so I don't miss out on the shrine, let's put the sensor on, because I really want to get it. Okay, it's not even activating. Oh my gosh, these guys are so cute. Dang, dude. Alright. Oh my! You are a bad boy! Where did that shrine go? I am so stupid, I should have marked it. When I could see it, because now I don't even see it. Well, I kind of want to get those luminous stones, so let's go grab those. So maybe we'll, we'll see the shrine again. I know there's the one by Gerudo Town, that's obvious, but... Let's grab these. Zap shroom. Luminous stones sell for, I think, 70 rupees each. That is a lot of money. Ah, there it is, right down there. Alright, perfect. Right in the deep down in this quarry, basically. Okay, I'm no longer in need of the shrine sensor, thank you. Dang, this place is cool too. You know what? Uh, maybe I should just leave like a uh, travel medallion here so that way I don't have to climb all the way out like when I'm done with the shrine. I guess there's an elevator thing right here. That's kind of cool. Wait, there was a stable right there. Oh, the K No Shrine. Who would have thought there's a stable at the very base of this quarry? All right, let's do another shrine, guys. We're done with towers. All we're gonna do now is shrines, puzzles, and divine beasts and things like that. Korok seeds, the Master Sword Trials, which we will do. Oh man. I love this game. I can't wait for Breath of the Wild 2. Power of Electricity, another one like this. Alright. I like these ones, they're fun. Okay. Need a small key for this one, I think? Oh, 
Oh, hi. Nice shot. Oh, it was too early. I'll take this beautiful light fixture thing. It's pretty heavy. Man, look at the orb when I spin. So cool. Just checking to see if there's a chest underneath or something crafty like that. This seems too easy. Oh, it's probably a small key. Alright. It is too easy. Please tell me there's more. Come on, give it to me. What you got? die if I even get hit once by that, now that I'm thinking about it. Let's put my uh, ancient armor on and whatnot so I don't die so easily in here. And uh, while I'm at it, I don't really want to heal just because I'm going to get full health if I beat the shrine. Did my ancient sword break already? Are you kidding me? Oh, get wrecked. Ow. That barely even hurt me. I'm breaking all my swords on this guy. I don't even care, though. Just gonna get one more here. Alright. Now, where were we? Ah, yes. We must pull these closer. Wait, that's it? That... that's it? Oh, okay, we did the shrine, guys! Kind of an easy one. I thought it would be a little bit better than that, to be honest. But hey, a spirit orb is a spirit orb, so I'm not complaining. Also, man... That fashion that I'm rocking right now, what should we call it? Like in in Dark Souls, it's it's Fashion Souls. In Brahalla, it's Fashion Hala. What's it called in uh, Breath of the Wild? Just just Zelda fashion? Like I don't I don't know. We need to come up with a clever name. There's the full health for free. I don't know why, but that like. That uh, crown of leaves, the golden leaves crown thing that I'm wearing is so cool. It just goes well with like any outfit, I feel almost. All right, um, right, let's get that, that ore. The stone smasher. Oh, actually, here's a sledgehammer right here, too. Oh, come on. There we go. Let's go check out the stables.
What a crazy spot for a stable. Oh, there's a couple rush room over here. Okay. What is this glowing thing? Just a light? Oh, we got a quest. Look at the dog. <laughs> oh my gosh, this guy's face. Oh, never mind. I thought the gang had come back. The gang? My friends. We were all traveling together when some monster suddenly jumped us near the Kuokot Plateau path. I took off running as fast as I could and didn't stop. So you ran away. When your friends and you got attacked, you left your friends to die. So you're a coward. But when I turned around to check on my friends, they were nowhere to be found. You don't think the monsters could... Uh, you think? You want me to go rescue your friends. Instead of you. You are the epitome of a coward, sir. Oh, doggy, doggy, doggy. Let's give the doggy some, uh... Let's give him some food here. Where's, where's my meat? Where's, where's my meat? Here we go. Give him some bird drumsticks. Here you go, boy. Sup, Cass? Actually, while I'm sitting here, uh, is there any Staminoka bass I got? Oh, yeah. We're needing these less and less the more stamina I have, but... You know, they still do come in handy from time to time, so also the hardy durians are really nice. Cook a couple of those together. We'll get full recovery plus eight. And let's do a uh, another Staminoka. I see a Gerudo chick over there. We got the painter dude over there who can tell me where memory is. Cass, you are just chilling everywhere I go. I feel like you're kind of stalking me at this point. But at the same time, you always get here before I... Wait, Beetle's... Oh, I thought that was Beetle. Oh, doggy's ready. Oh, it's right there. Come on, Star Fragment. Oh, just... Hey, ten ice arrows. That's actually a lot of ice arrows. Alright, Beetle, where'd you go? I, I saw you in here. There he is. I just want to buy some arrows and stuff. Wow! Wow! Saw, <laughs> saw! Oh, yeah. I'll take them all. Oops. Yeah. Oh, uh, let's see. Let's oh. sell a little bit. Sell a little bit, shall we? We're gonna be rich, boys. Um. I mean, I got 14 of those. 22 of those. I got so many gems. Uh, let's just sell some amber. I have a lot of these. Let's just sell like 20 of them. We'll be rich for a while. Oh no, only 600 rupees? That's actually not that, that much. But I do have 91 of these. Let's sell like 40 of them. <laughs> A little bit more money. Uh, what else should we sell? Alright. I guess we could sell a couple uh, luminous stone. Or should we sell some opal? Let's sell five topaz. 900 right there. Yeah, I think we're good on money. What do you guys think? It's not like I'm trying to buy anything right now anyways. No, 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 no. We're done, we're done, we're done. Alright, thanks, Beetle. Alright, guys, I'm gonna end the episode here. However, uh, if you are interested in some bonus footage, I'm gonna go ahead and start summoning all my amiibo, so... This is pretty much the end of the video, but if you want to see me summon all my amiibos, see what we get, stick around. In fact, I'm going to go right over here to do it because we're going to need some empty space. Alright, let's get started. I got a lot of amiibos to go through.
By the way, guys, thank you for watching. Please drop a like if you enjoyed. And as always, I hope to see you in the next episode. Take it easy, guys.
Once again. 